Seen a tough loss against Manchester City 3 0 at home at Old Trafford. Are some of you guys still everything I'm in? I have to ask that question. Now, this is a genuine question. I'm not being facetious or funny. I'm being dead serious. Are you still everything I'm out at this stage of the season? Yes, this is not half of the season, but dude, this is like one third of the season. Next month is November. Tomorrow is November. Technically, is me in some areas. But we're almost in November, and November is almost December. And up to this part of the season, we haven't seen a gratifying reason for us to believe that we can not only get top four, but to come out of the mess that we're in in the Champions League group stage and to advance to the next, uh, the next stage of the Champions League and also try to improve on our style of play, trying to improve on the performances. There is no competition. Compen I can't even talk, bro. There is no compensity. Not compensity. There is no com. We're not competent at the moment, basically. We're not competent. We're not competent. And if you look at this manager, that is the man in question right now. Are you everything in or are you everything out? Now, there are some persons that are still hanging on to that branch that is falling down with them because they know that eventually they go fall, they go fall down with this bridging. He's not going to last long at this club. I wouldn't even say he's going to, I don't even think he's going to last long in the next three weeks. We have a decent amount of fixtures. We have Newcastle on Wednesday in the AFL Cup, but I'm going to do the preview tomorrow. It might be a, a funeral procession on Wednesday, but I'm ready for it. <laughs> but this manager, everything Hag out, how far do you see him taking this Manchester United squad? What expectation do you have of this guy at Manchester United, given that we are basically out of the champions league not to be pessimistic but by the looks of it you know we go we're we not go so far the group stages we're just not is the form of, if the style is the style of play going to improve given that the players the majority dude i don't want to be here no excuses right there is no major player apart from lissandra martinez that is injured for us to come out without chess and say you know what let us give the manager some time there are some crucial players that are injured i don't want to be hearing that as injury as injury prone as Varan is, is me, given that he didn't even play against Man City for what? Oh, for tactical reasons, because you know, you know, uh he, he only comes down to my system. My system includes a centre back that can play on the right hand side and another centre back that can play on the left hand side. And Rafael Varan, yes, he's won the Champions League, he's won the 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 the, 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 the World Cup. He's not suited to play on the left hand side or in the, the, the defence ahead of Maguire Evans. Now again, this is a um a, a injury prone player, is me. But a player of of Varan's pedigree that didn't sniff a cent on the football pitch yesterday against Man City is horrendous. This version should have started, even if he picked up an injury yesterday. Thank God, is me. But then again, is he intentionally looking to get sucked? Is this what you want, Eric Tong? If you want it, if you want to get sucked, then say it. You know, again, bro, leave at the give earliest given moment because. Right now you're in hot water. That pot is boiling to the to the point where you're like a boiled frog. You want to jump out of the pot, you see me? You no, know, the most of the majority of the fans are not behind you. Then you just know, me as some person would say pause, but they they're not backing what you're trying to do. They're not backing what you're trying to implement. I still question what you're trying to implement. What have you implemented since coming? Uh, since the season started, you have implemented drama. You have brought this brethren into your post-press press conference talking about he didn't do well in training. Now he's not even in the squad. You exile this guy from the training, the training regime to go train with the kids or something. What's that about? You think that's helping your cause to sell this club? To try and to off, you know, make yourself authoritarian? No, man. As, as far as I'm concerned, you're not fit to, to manage Manchester United. You'll be gone by late November is my best guess. Is me. And November is my month. So for you for me to want to gone in my month, dude, that says a lot. Is it because is it me? I don't I don't I don't want to be having no sack manager in my month. But as things look, seeing that October is finishing right now. And of uh November starts on Wednesday. If you lose against Newcastle on Wednesday 
I don't see you're going down a street of call call no return. You're not going to you're, you're not going to return in the favor of Manchester United fans. Leave your comments above below in the comment section. What's your thought on it? Do you are you everything in on or out? Or are you some of you guys are still neutral? You know, some of you guys still neutral. Some some of you guys, you know, are on that fence. Which one are you? Everything again? Out? In and out? <laughs> Or on the fence where you are like between two minds. Leave your comments below in the comment section. I want to hear what you guys have to say. And with that being said, I'm out.